see Steven Jackson and Wallow come running over there. I think that was a separate altercation, though. No. That was the same altercation? Mm-hmm. That's crazy. Mm-hmm. <laughs> That shit was funny. They had to. Meek was like, "Wallow, we not doing all that." Yeah, they stopped the fight and all that for that shit. Yeah, Meek was. He looked drunk. He looked drunk and out of shape. I ain't gonna hold you. Yeah, I forget the boxer's name, but I'll get it. I'll get it. I'll get it. That shit was funny as hell, though. Oh, you see this story is out right now with uh, that young dude, Kasanak. Kasanak. It's not, yeah. No. It's the, I've been telling you, I've been watching them lately, like the AMP shit and all that type shit. He be on YouTube and all that type shit. Mm-hmm. But anyways, he threw a, a, a New Year's Eve party. Mm-hmm. And this girl that was there claimed that one of his friends raped her. So now, you know, the shit, the, the internet was dragging him and shit like that. He had to, he said, yo, I ain't, he ain't talk for a couple of days. He was like, yo, I ain't talk because... First thing I did was went to the law. Like, I'm not playing no games with this. I take this serious. Yeah, I'm not going to kill my career. You know what I'm saying? So he told his story. He was like, he met her on New Year's Eve on the 31st. Like, when he was out and about that day, throughout the day of the 31st. So he said he met her and he was like, yo, if you were in New York, you know what I mean? We going to throw a New Year's Eve party. I'm just inviting people to my shit. He just invited mad people to his shit. So then he said the night was going on, she was drunk or whatever, and he was like, I right, if you want to, I don't want you to take a cab or nothing. There's rooms upstairs you could go and sleep. And then he said somebody came downstairs running a couple hours later and told him this and that and the third, and she was claiming somebody like raped her and shit. She was like, it was your friend that was with you. And he was like, whoa, Casa. And I was like, whoa, what friend? Like, I don't know. I don't know who you talk about, you know what I'm saying? But then he found out who she was talking about. He's just taking legal actions with it, you know what I'm saying? He's not playing no games with his career, you know what I mean? He like, yo, if my friend was wrong, you fucked up, my nigga. Like, what? I can't have you around me doing shit like that. You just go in the room and rape shorty, bro. And then if shorty wrong, it's like, we, we gonna press charges on you and all that type shit, you know what I'm saying? But I'm not saying no more until they tell me what happened, bro. Like... I'm surprised it wasn't like no cameras and shit in his rooms and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? Like, you just one streamer of the year, nigga. Like, <laughs> yeah. I'd have every camera on in my shit, nigga. You just one streamer of the year. <clears throat> getting that money up. You getting bread. For real. And you invite strangers to his house? Yeah, bro. And it was like a mix of people. He because you saw that clip when it was like a boogie and his girl casting that girls arguing. That was that night. That's the that's the party, bro. So he had rappers and shit there and all that type of shit. Nigga. You can't you can't you learn from this, nigga. <laughs> you you <y'all> can't <laughs> NDAs nothing. Just inviting niggas to the yeah. Take the elevator upstairs. <laughs> yeah. <sighs> I know that's exactly what you're thinking. You cannot just you invite randoms. You cannot ever in life, whether you broke, rich, or in between, just invite strangers to get intoxicated with other strangers yes, and just see how the night is going to end. See what happens. <laughs> There's too many different ways that that night can end. Yeah, you inviting too many personalities into your home. That don't know each other. Mm-hmm. On the wildest night of the year. Mm-hmm. No security cameras. Sounds like there was no security there. Something like this was bound to happen. Nobody was patted down or nothing. See, I don't know the, you know what I mean? I don't know Couldn't the extra been. details. Couldn't have been. You just letting niggas in yeah, the crib. Yeah, you just telling niggas to pull up. Females and all, I don't give a fuck. Female, but see, I'm not, I'm not gender biased. Uh, I, I know females that are boom shit. Yeah, so <laughs> you not just getting invited, and you, especially in the middle of the day, I'm gonna see your address, and you gonna pull us in my spot where I got bread, jewelry, yeah, and all a, that. That's a mistake on your end, my nigga. Lucky right? you, ain't, you lucky to be alive. For real. Because what else? Because if it was a different, yeah. What other females did you invite? 
Yeah, because if it was a different type of chick, she would have got niggas got to come line, in with her. Line up. Yeah. Line them up and shut them down. So you got to be more careful out there, Kyle. Like, you worth something now, man. Mm-hmm. So, um,. Even from even if you out there, and you just just a regular person. Just move right, man. Be careful. Pussy, I have you in jail. Yeah, you never know how a person is feeling on the day or the day after or a couple days after. Like they might could say something and you just be all fucked up in the situation. You know what I'm saying? So I don't know. Like keep your head up. You know what I mean? You ever heard? Yeah, you know me to be mixed up with women since you've known me, right? Mm-hmm. You ever heard some shit like that about me? You, I ever been in some shit like that, or no, a woman saying, no, no. or a girl tell me I, that nigga touched me, and no, never, right? No. And I've dealt with men, right? No, yeah, we we usually the type of dudes that's trying, that's like helping women with shit like yeah. that. They come to us and tell us shit like that happened to them. They, cause they talk to people that they comfortable with. You know what I'm saying? So, see, I never put any female into a position where I'm forcing myself on them. Yeah, like. When shit happening for me is because they taking their clothes off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, <laughs> yeah, like the woman. You know what I'm I, yeah, they grabbing, I learned that they shit. Grabbing up yeah, me. I learned that shit, man. Long ago, like the women, the woman always has the ball in their court. It's, it's always the ball in their court. It don't matter if you was pursuing them or whatever. It's dead when they say it's time. That's when it's time. You know what I'm saying? Yep. So you gotta wait for that. I, man. I, it's women that been like, yo, you. You don't be like, you can push a little more. I'll be like, nah, I'll wait. Because I don't ever want to be accused of some sexual crime. Like, that. Yeah, that is neither. sexual crime or anything with kids. I just, I just can't, man. I can't stand for it. So, I don't know, man. Just relax. <laughs> It's pretty just easy. Relax. Don't be so thirsty. Whoever you know what Duke saying? is, just relax, bro. Yeah. I mean, if she was willing to come to a stranger's house mm-hmm. and get intoxicated, she was comfortable. Yeah. So at some point, if you just chilling and relaxing, even if it's not that night, my nigga, if you don't hit, one of the homies going to kill. Yeah, you just fuck the play up. Fuck it all <laughs> up. Being fast, nigga. Nigga yeah. trying to steal third. And then they, but they saying that she, uh, she like scratched son face up so well she should have yeah that, you gotta leave some type of evidence right you should have should have scratched him <laughs> yeah bro so i don't know I, i'm kind of invested in the story i want to see what happens you know what i'm saying because he's a smart man though that's what you do yeah 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 he didn't say nothing for like two or three days bro he went straight to his legal team he was like yo what i do with this they was like yo go to the cops tell them exactly what happened and then we'll give you the green light when you could speak your piece you know what i'm saying because every we know how this internet shit work everybody gonna drag you because you the person you know what i mean you the face you you the person that's out there so no, but he's doing the right thing there's gonna be a few stupid motherfuckers that be like oh he's snitching no that is not nah, snitching. Nah, nah, nah. you don't stand with no shit like that nah no hell sexual nah. fucking predator hell no nah, i don't know how i don't care how long i known you nigga if uh, not accusations, but if something come to the light like that and it's facts, it's like, bro, come on, my nigga. I got you around chicks with me, my female friends, nigga. Not even chicks that I'm fucking. I got you around female friends and shit. And you looking at them like you gonna thinking about yeah, command, pray type shit. Command a heinous crime, come on, bro. Fuck out of here, bro. You can't face, say that bro. you not. That's crazy. You seen the story? Oh, six year old boy shoots a shoots his teacher. In Virginia, in the school. Purposely? He failed him? For Christmas? I told you I know how to spell tree, motherfucker. He failed him for Christmas. I don't know, bro. He He couldn't get the PS5. He didn't get that P5. He killed him? He had the hammer in the crib, though. He killed him? Yeah. He killed the teacher? (laughs) Get the (laughs) fuck out of here. Six years old, bro, in Virginia, bro. It's crazy. I'll show you the story right there. Get the fuck (laughs) out of here. (laughs) Nigga said, you made that shit up out the blue, nigga. Nah, you serious? (laughs) I'm dead ass, over here creating fake news now. Oh, this nigga Correa went to sign with the um, twins. Yeah, he went back. I was going to tell you when we got the sports. He's a nigga. You so old. Something wrong with him. (laughs) Something wrong with him. Y'all ain't, good thing y'all ain't put that money up. Yo, but what are you talking about right now? The teacher's injuries are believed to be life-threatening. Nigga. Oh, he on.